The year 1543 was one of the most fateful in the history of Western civilization. It was not because of a great battle or some dramatic shift in the balance of power. There was no great natural disaster. No new king was crowned. But an event occurred that year, the seismic consequences of which were unimaginable at the time. The event set in motion an intellectual revolution. That revolution would displace man from his central place in the order of the cosmos, the place he had occupied for the previous 2,000 years. From then on, human beings would be regarded by science as accidental byproducts of a cosmos that did not have them in mind. But even as this bleak view became ascendant, new scientific discoveries were being made that would return humans to their special place in the universe. These new discoveries revealed an astonishing truth. Nature is exquisitely fit for beings like ourselves. This is Michael Denton. I'm a biologist and a medical doctor. I've spent my life investigating the wonders of the natural world. In my book, The Miracle of Man, I provide what is to my knowledge the most comprehensive review in print of nature's unique fitness for human biology. I describe a stunning set of ensembles of prior environmental fitness, many clearly written into the laws of nature from the moment of creation, enabling the actualization of key defining attributes of our biology. While my conclusions may be controversial, the evidences upon which my conclusions are based are not in the least controversial. In virtually every case, they are so firmly established in the relevant scientific disciplines as to be now considered wholly uncontroversial conventional wisdom. In other words, the extraordinary ensembles of natural environmental fitness described in my book are thoroughly documented scientific facts. All I have done is to bring them together so you can see not just the individual pieces of the puzzle, but the entire picture. I invite you to explore the miracle of man. <laughs>